Good morning, beautiful Libras, and welcome back to the channel, everybody. I hope everybody is recovered from Christmas. Guys, I want to thank you ever so much for all your beautiful comments, your likes, and your subscriptions. Welcome to all you new subscribers. Let's find out what's going on for Libra. <clears throat> Libra energy spirit, what's going on for the beautiful Librans? What about Libra? Whoa. Help from spirit is here. Here as family. Right place, right time, Libra. You're very pleasing to God, whatever it is. You're here as family, spirit is saying. You're going to be at the right place at the right time because you are pleasing God. The energy of love. We just relax and be. You're always with God. <laughs> Libra. This, no, this one wants to show. Future potentials are coming in. You're powerful, Spirit is saying, Libra, and according to all your messages that I've been getting, you definitely are. We're all here as family, and you are part of Spirit's family, that's for sure. You're pleasing God. You give off the energy of love. Just relax and be. You're always with God, and there are future potentials here. You're going to be at the right place at the right time, Libra. What's going on here for Libra? Libra, please, Spirit. Libra. A circle of eternal joy. Timelessness. The dance of life. Setting boundaries. Threshold protection and honor. You're embodying the divine feminine energy. Earth magic is being performed. So just relax, Spirit is saying, and at the right place, at the right time, there is some grateful, something to be grateful for, a joyous view of the future. Future potentials are looking great. Idyllic times. The garden, the paradise, summoning your power. You are very powerful, Spirit is saying. Learning of joy, art, and music. Gaining wisdom through art, through joy, through music. The power over difficulty, reclaiming your power. I'm liking it. River of blessings coming in, Spirit is saying. What's going on, beautiful Libra? That's a lot. Those are blessings. So you got nothing to worry about. Spirit is saying relax and be because you're being blessed. You're going to be at the right place at the right time. You are powerful. Something you're stood in your absolute truth. Hold high honor, self-respect, and you're very responsible. You're rebirthing something. It is abundance. And it's like, hmm, focuses here. Somebody can't focus because they may have fears. But Spirit is telling you, stand in your truth. Letting go of these fears. Letting go of these worries. Physical health, grounding, and, and bound, and a firm foundation. Forgiveness is here. Someone is standing in their leadership and in their pride. Maybe somebody was in their pride. And maybe you've let go of something. Somebody may want your forgiveness. Tell the truth. Rebirth something with you. Whatever it is, they can't focus and they're afraid. So if those are fears of yours, you got to let them go. Spirit is saying, relax, you're more powerful than you realize. You're about to receive a river of blessings. What's going on? And it could be the person around you as well. Let's find out. 
Libra. I just know by you standing in your truth, you having self-respect, you've learned to let go of your fears, learning to let go so you can focus in on your truth, in on your abundance, finding forgiveness. Forgiveness is not always for the other person. It is for ourselves. But I'm thinking somebody wants this is celebrating. This is a solid foundation. Now, what's going on? Success. You're very intuitive and you're trusting your intuition. You're on a new cycle. So you may have closed out a cycle. Yeah, there's that fear, that worry. Spirit is saying, don't worry. There's this sadness. Hmm. Maybe they're regretting what they did. Hmm. They've ended something with a third party. I think that they're regretting they ever were in it. And I think that they're afraid you're going to reject them, but the past wants to return. Hmm. And you've drawn the line. You have set up boundaries. I don't know. Somebody wants to work on a family a uh, happy family situation. I think that this person could have been narcissistic. I think that this person, well, I don't know. That could be envy and jealousy. I don't know because there's somebody entering your life. <laughs> Solid King of Pentacles. Hmm. Seeing that this karmic was a hoe. <laughs> oh my God. And it's ended with a tower. You're single, abundant. Hmm. Maybe they were selfishness involved here. But you were divinely protected. The angels are here. Temperance angel trying to balance things back out in your life. You are divinely protected. You are one with God. It's saying you're very powerful. Somebody is watching you, doing a lot of thinking about you. Yes, they are. And it hurts them. They're hurt. They hurt you. You're abundant. Someone's holding on to you. You may have blocked somebody because they hurt you, but they're watching you. Hmm. Yeah, because something ended painfully. Somebody walked away. Hmm. There's that fear. Maybe they put you in fear. I don't know. You're getting a sweet victory. I do know that. And I do know you're getting attention from a lot of people. And I think that this person is watching you, wanting your attention. Hmm. It hurts them that you are getting attention. Because they've got the Wheel of Fortune in reverse. They're not doing too well. They're stuck in their karma. <sighs> For all the things they did under the moon, it's in reverse. Jeez. Everything is in reverse. Good news is you're getting happy. You stood in your absolute truth and the judgment is going in your favor and this emperor is getting judgment. Everything is turning out bad for them. The wheel of fortune in reverse, the queen of pentacles in reverse, the moon in reverse, the only thing is they're stuck in this unfortunate situation, like in their karma. They're not getting lucky. It's going in reverse, guys. They're getting judged for what they did to you, Empress. But there is an emperor here. <sighs> yeah, they're heavily burdened. Hmm, I think they've left that situation. 
somebody got left out in the cold, they could have lost a bunch of money. Hmm. Hmm. Hang on, guys. Page of Pentacles, feeling like a fool that they took a sexual action, but uh, there could be someone taking a leap of faith. Hang on, we'll find out. Maybe somebody wants to restart something. Let's see. Hmm. That's the chariot. Maybe they do. This is the Hierophant. Learning a lesson. This is a spiritual union. You're moving forward. This is yin and yang. You took your power back. Ooh, there's a spiritual contract here coming in, moving toward you. It is love. It's a new spiritual contract. It is the yin to your yang here. Someone's coming toward you with a, a spiritual contract. And it's looking like the trumpets have sounded right place, right time, when the timing is right. You stood in the absolute truth. This person fell into a lie. It's been revealed that this person was lying. But you stood in your truth. Hmm. Hostilities, anger. Because hmm. someone was confused by a devil. <laughs> Started feeding the devil. That's what they did. Started giving to a karmic. Magician. Juggling. Trying to confuse the situation. I don't know. Somebody who owes you an apology or somebody wants to come toward you with a love offer is the contract. So we got a past here trying to return, guys, with an apology. If not, if you're not accepting this person's apology, there's a new love offer coming in. Like you may even accept this apology. It doesn't mean you're going to connect with them. Some of you will. Some of you are holding out for a new uh, offer. There is a soulmate contract coming in. Hmm. Could have been dealing with a king of wands, a king of cups. This is a match. This is a spiritual justice here. This is a wish fulfilled, a wish granted. Two people loving one another. To be fair, to be balanced. Someone is offering you a cup of love here. Hmm. They've been betrayed by another lover. It's in reverse. It's done. Here's a new opportunity. A blessing. Someone is coming in to communicate. I want to come rushing in. This is like I've waited long enough. I can't wait anymore. This is waiting for the right opportunity, the right timing. Hmm. Yeah. See? They cheated themselves. They could have had options. They chose the wrong option. This is a commitment. This is that river of blessings coming in. Whatever you've been waiting for is coming in. Oh. They might have to fight for you, I'm just saying. <laughs> They might have a fight on their hands. I think this person is 
was in their ego. I think they were doing an internal battle with themselves. But I think by the time they do come in, there is competition in the mix here. Look how abundant and happy you are. There's a new love offer. There is competition here. They're going to have to fight for you. I'm just saying because there is a new love offer coming in. That makes you very happy. These are blessings coming in. Whether you're single and you're just giving birth to your own abundance, river of blessings is coming in toward you. They're going to have a fight on their hands. I'm just saying. They're waiting. Somebody's waiting for the right time, the right opportunity to come rushing in. They're looking out toward the future, seeing you, that this is somebody I could be committed to. This is somebody who I can see my future with, my happiness with. They're the love of my life. I see a happy Ten of Cups situation, a Ten of Pentacles situation. Uh-oh, here they are going to have competition. Wouldn't it just be the way spirit works? You like getting attention from someone else. You find new love and now this person wants to come in to, to keep you from this love connection. You're going to have to watch out for that because this person is willing to do battle. And they may be coming in trying to mess up your new connection because of their jealousy, because of their um, aggressive ways. I'm just saying. It's like they want to beat up anybody who comes near you. So it's like if they can't have you, they don't want anybody else to want you. Well, this person is going to do battle. They will fight. And uh, the new person will take it on. They're strong and they're brave and they will take it on. They're like, bring it on, buddy, sister, whoever. They'll fight for you, this person. They mean what they say. They say what they mean and they're not messing around. They mean it. They're like, I'll do whatever it takes here to win beautiful Libra over all oh, right time right place it's gonna come in it's just gonna be because you're so powerful you're being so highly blessed here Libra I don't know if you were doing lousy in your past you will not be in your future Someone is going to do battle for you. Take care, Libra.